three on three. Um, um, so Naveen comes to the crease now, and when he's, when he's walking out, um, Rivaldo Clark runs straight past him and runs straight to me. Nothing in his hand, no drinks, no towels, nothing. Just a message. And he says, Rothman says, you bat the last two balls, just stay still and hit the ball. Okay, boys, just a word from me. I'm very relaxed normally as well, and I like this jovial atmosphere, but this is pretty shit. We've come here all half asleep. Everyone's dawdling around. It looks like we're unfocused. We're gonna come here tomorrow and get thrashed. I just wanna give us a wake-up call here. It feels very weird compared to every other practice we've had. And we've gotta maintain those high things that we do. Okay, please, guys, let's switch on from now. This game is not for bowlers. Uh, that also hmm? prompts me to ask you if this game is not for bowlers and if this ground is not for bowlers, what does that tackle in your arm mean? <laughs> it's my best figures in T20 cricket and I got it at this ground against India. I think what gives confidence to me is the, is the rhythm on the day as well. The conditions, you know, that gives confidence to me. Fellas, um, tonight, tonight provides, presents another opportunity, another opportunity for one of our big players, another opportunity for one of our match winners to stand up on the counter. You know, it's a beautiful ground, pitch looks a little bit different from what I normally see here, but hopefully it's still a good wicket. If we win it, us, we're going to ball first. Best of luck to everyone. We have one change as it regards our team, unfortunately, Alec is out. And in comes Kedin Allen making his debut. I also think that spinners will be a little more important uh, at this venue for today's match because this is the fourth match being played on the same pitch. So I expect there to be a little higher degree of turn. I expect spinners to also know exactly how to bowl defensively. I'm really uh, excited to look at Mahesh bowling to Dapa. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! That is spun from outside the leg stump, past the bat, and onto the stumps. More for his drift and swing that he get. Ah! What a start this is as well from Wallalega. The fingers up. There are three down. There's that change of pace, and this is when Obed McCoy is at his absolute best. Man is right there, and he's cut down. The wheels just beginning to come off now for the Barbados Royals. Last couple of overs. Yeah, so I've got a few catches in CPL before, so it's not, it's not our first one. Um, catching under the lights is, is quite difficult, especially it has a big wing factor at ground, like St. Kitts. So initially when the ball went up off of Jason, I was under the ball and the wind just started to push back the ball. So that's why you'll see me falling more forward in, in, into the ball and actually dropping the catch. Um, 
Uh, when I came off the field, the whole support staff was there. And they just told me, well done in the field. No, no crickets or anything. I remember Trash telling me, Naeem, don't worry about that, you have to back school for us. Back in the team room, Rothman said, schoolboy, you've got a back for me. You know, and I, I just sat down in my chair, took a minute for myself, and just switched back on. That presents an opportunity for another very exciting prospect this year, which is Kadeem. I think he he is someone whom I'm really banking that could be a major hit in this entire CPL. Acres of space out on the leg side straight. Straight and far enough. Yeah, he was throwing the ball in straight, so I was just trying to maximize, just trying to hit him straight, keep it simple. Oh, he got into such a good position to be able to access that leg side boundary. Heinrich Nokia gets him to chop on. Oh, that's brilliant. Knowing that the mid-off was up, anything in his arc, he was going to go for it. Low full toss, out towards the leg side, and a brilliant catch by Clarkson, what? When I got to the next end, obviously, needed seven or eight from, from four. Um, I guess give myself some space, um, fix my gloves, and just really think about what I really wanted to do. The third ball the over, um, I ran on the wicket, uh, trying to put the ball off his length, also trying to play in his mind. Uh, luckily for me, I got inside edge, past the keeper, went for four. Three on three. Um, he was a really good, really good Yorker. Um, didn't expect the ball to be honest to be pitched there. I just clipped my pad, went to Fletcher, and when I when I, when I looked up, uh, T Channel was right in my face. <laughs> he just ran straight down, and I just I was just got back in my crease, and um, unfortunately he got he got run he got run out. Vegan comes to the crease now, and when he's when he's walking out, um, Rivaldo Clark runs straight past him. I ran straight to me, nothing in his hand, no drinks, no towels, nothing. Just a message. And he says, Rothman says, you back the last two balls, just stay still and hit the ball. Uh, the fifth ball will be over, I was in the entry from two. Going through my mind was that, obviously if he, if he misses, I think that ground is quite small and I think I could take advantage of that. Three needed from two. Oh, what a way to finish for the Barbados Royals. Great, great win, boys. That's proper head. So many occasions there, it looked like we might not win and we ended up scraping over the line and that's fantastic. That's what it's all about. When you don't play that well and you still win. Um, we've got a, someone leaving us and I thought you came in as a replacement player and uh, wish you all the best. I think you're going to be a fantastic cricketer, you are one already, and you fit it in so well, and you do so well for us, so all the best on your side. <laughs> Perfect game. We have all the areas that we need to work on. But having said that, 
Cool. I played some good cricket. I played some good cricket tonight. You know? Um, they have been a fantastic addition to the franchise. Travel safe home and we'll always remember you here, okay? Man, so if you're great, man, you're gonna have a great night.